Well, at, when I first left college, I had a great hope that I would be able to make my living writing um, and that uh, doing creative writing, and that um, became quite clear quickly that I would not be able to do that. So I thought journalism seemed a wonderful way to be able to write consistently, and um, and I like so much talking with people and trying to find their stories. Uh, so that that seemed like a very good fit. So I got to the journalism school. And I think this might be what you're referring to the, in the podcast that they did with me. It was very hard because I was used to writing these very long, lyrical, descriptive um, stories that didn't have a lot of structure. <laughs> and, um, and journalism school, just it, you have to get to the point. You have to have an organization. Things have to be clear. And it was really sort of a, a disassembling, a disarticulating of my writing that was very painful and that I didn't agree with a lot of the time, um, but that I think in the end allowed me to slowly start to put things back together in a way that, that could move my writing forward so that I would think much more about not just my own engagement with description and with describing the world, but with what I was communicating to people, how it was structured, the pacing, a lot of things that I think Hawks had been pushing me to but that I hadn't gotten to, and I, you know, I, I think that will be an ongoing work, work mm -hmm. forever. Um, yeah, and also, did, were you writing uh, science-related uh, or historical uh, mm. fiction? No, I wasn't. And what was very interesting was that the discovery. I, I thought when I went to the journalism school, I would write about arts and culture. And I had discovered that what I really loved writing about, um, what I would get very passionate about, was public health and science. And the, I think part of the reason for the engagement with science is that it allows you to describe the natural world and processes with, uh, with lyricism, if you can. And so it really connected for me with what I had always loved about about describing. Um, and it seemed that I could bring these different elements together by writing about science and have been very lucky to be able to do that, I feel.